Can she not? I was just, I was so shook when she came in, like the whole thing, the whole, like I, I literally just finished playing, cause I'm really about to think, and then she like, yoinks me in, just her. <laughs> I'm such a simp, bro. I see the new Evo, Joe, that jogging gonna gossip, boom, and on the pop. I was about to check out some Tori Kelly right now who dropped a song featuring none other than our girl Kim Chewon of the Seraphim and the song is called Spruce. I have not heard it yet but I do know that accounts were sharing a small like a snippet of it like for a while now. I forget exactly for how long but they have been sharing a snippet of it. I have not listened to it um, but I think this is dope. I do love seeing when artists collab with each other. Um, then I think this is really cool and I would love to know uh, what kind of song they drop together so I'm not gonna be yapping anymore I'm still a little shook because spoiler alert there was an earthquake here like not too long ago like half an hour ago and <laughs> it was my first earthquake and it was not fun it was kind of spooky <laughs> not gonna lie I wasn't scared but I thought my builder was gone I also want to let y'all know these batteries ain't gonna last they are gone very soon because I did not charge them and I've used them for like two, two or three reactions already today. <laughs> All right, uh, Tori Kelly Spruce featuring Kim Chewon. And let's start that over. Bro, Tori Kelly, by the way, there we go. There we go. Tori Kelly, by the way, has an amazing voice. She has an amazing voice. One of my favorite things from her, bro, is not even her song. She she did a cover of Colors of the Wind for Disney a long time ago. It feels like it's been, I, I think I might have still been in high school, honestly, or just out of high school when that dropped. But it's old, and I, it's one of my favorite Disney songs, period. And she sang it, and at that point, I kind of like fell for her voice a lot. I, I listened to her a bit. But not to the point where like I still listen to her. I haven't listened to Tori Kelly in a very long time. But that's like one of my favorite things from her, bro. Because that's where I, I think that's where I got introduced to her. It was through that cover of Colors of the Wind. And that's one it's literally my favorite Tori Kelly thing ever. Okay, let me go back. It sounds like a. It sounds like one of those. It's a very vibey song. I will be honest. To this point, not really my thing. I am here to get my girl Che one on it though. I was just, I was so shook when she came in, like the whole thing, the whole, like I, I literally just finished playing, cause I'm really about to think, and then she like, yoinks me in, just her. <laughs> I'm such a simp, bro. <laughs> I want you to know, when she first came in, like obviously I see her highlighted, but they are singing this shit so, in such a similar way, that I almost wondered if the lyric video was wrong. But then when it got to this, like, to the, oh, oh, love, you look good and everything, like, I I heard it more. But the begin when it first switched to her, bro, I'm like, 
Did we chase people or not? What happened? I think it has more to do with like the style in which the song is saying, right? Like it, it has to do with that. Like a very like airy or breathy way of saying. I don't know if that's what I'm describing it correctly, but you know what I mean, right? Hopefully you don't like that. Here I It was that what to do that got me, bro. But she had me the whole time. I was like, wait, what's going on? It's not like a it's not like a skip. I'm just saying it's not like one of my everyday things, you know. I look at her chill one on it, bro. She sounds so good. To be fair, Tori sounds really good on it too. Also very short. When I said it's one of those, it kind of felt like one of those that might go viral on a TikTok, the way it sounds. Oh, she, she, she blow a kiss too, bro? Oh my god! See, and I'm dancing to it. I'm saying, like, it's not bad, bro. <laughs> it's good. It's a nice song for sure. See, I, I love seeing, like, people I'm already fond of in, like, the K pop bro, just feature on other artists' songs. Um, not simply, like, just Western artists, but seeing them as features, like, I just reacted to earlier today. Um, winter featuring on Yedam song, bro. I just I love it, bro, because it's like knowledge, bro. You, you know, you know why you're bringing them in. They fit the vibe, and it's just good decisions all around. It, it's good, bro. It's good. It's just not something. I don't think it's something like I would play out, go out of my way to play and like listen to all the time. But um, it's a nice song. It's a nice vibe. And like I said, it just has that that sound of something that would probably go like some part of this would go viral on TikTok. It just feels that way. I think they both sound really nice, but they also both sound very similar in these first parts of the of their main verses. <laughs> they sound very similar.